Hi, Vince Riley with Stormwind Studios. I'm not sure if you've seen, but VMware recently announced with vSphere 6.7 update one, there is now a fully functioning uh, vSphere client, more affectionately known as the H5 client, the HTML5 client to be specific. So you're probably aware that um, there was not full feature parity between the vSphere web client as well as the vSphere client or the H5 client. Um, it was announced recently in the vSphere blog, and I don't know if you've ever been to the vSphere blog, but sometimes VMware puts this here, not necessarily on their main page, uh, new announcements, but this I saw, and there is full functioning or full functionality with the vSphere client, which is a good thing. We've been asking for uh, the vSphere uh, client to be fully functional and it's kind of difficult as an administrator sometimes this function works but then we have to go back to the web client it is now fully functional which is a good thing highlighting a couple of things the dashboard it gives us that quick dashboard like view an overview of our virtual infrastructure also uh, we've got search functionality if we've tagged inventory objects and we want to search for those that's uh, available to us uh, who doesn't want a dark theme? Uh, we've got a dark theme available to us as well. Uh, the workflow for vCenter server high availability is part of this as well. And uh, it seems like there was one other thing that I wanted to point out. Uh, performance charts. That was a, a point of contention as well. When we're monitoring things, uh, we didn't have that full functionality. We now have that in the 6.7 update one vSphere client we can pop those performance charts into another tab and um, monitor our environment as well as doing other things. For a full list of all of the updates, uh, there's a link in this blog post that you can get. And what I've done is I've actually highlighted or searched for, which highlights all of the different um, updates uh, that were part of this vSphere 6.7 update one for the vSphere client. So I hope uh, that you spend some time out on the vSphere blog and getting some information. But if you have any questions, feel free to um, send us a note. I uh, appreciate the feedback. Uh, but thank you for watching. Have a great day.